Hello guys, welcome to another jQuery video tutorial and this video we will learn how to use the droppable functionality of jQuery UI and in this video um, we will start doing some uh, cool features uh, using droppable but as well with the uh, draggable that we learned from the last video okay so first of all uh, create a drop.html file don't forget to put your um, path to your jQuery files okay and the jQuery UI um, so down here what we have to do first of all is let's create a span span ID let's call this name it's going to be Victor and span and here another span ID call name and let's call this Tom span and another one span ID equals city London span okay so we have three different spans and um, now in the script let us type document dot ready and function square brackets okay so the first thing I'm going to do is obviously use the um, droppable so I need to create down here a div first of all div ID let's call this drop drop box and um, let's close this div save this and let me CSS st style style and this is going to be the drop box and let's give it a height of 200 pixels and a width of 200 pixels and background color is going to be yellow okay let's save this let's go down here and now I'm gonna grab the drop box and uh, here I'm gonna type dot and this is going to be droppable and save this and if we start this in the Chrome let me see the result this okay so we have now Victor London Tom in London and uh, we can't uh, drag them yet because we have to create obviously the draggable uh, function in here first as well so let's type um, let's type name and city okay because we want to be able to grab them all okay so city and name dot uh, draggable in here let's type containment document document comma 
revert true and start function and here let's type uh, t -t 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 content equals to this dot text save this now down here let me just check this first okay cool perfect now what I want to do is to make able to to be able to put these inside the box this box itself okay so to do that I have to come up in here droppable droppable parenthesis and curly braces and over I'm gonna do a little effect which is um, I'm gonna put a border to whenever I um, pass over it okay over that box so over class let's type here a border okay and this is going to be a class that I'm going to create in CSS in here so class border and let's type border one pixel solid and black okay save this and okay let me see if this is working refresh and perfect okay you see very cool feature whenever I uh, put something in the box uh, the box itself um, turns a border uh, a black border uh, into a solid black one pixel okay very cool so let's proceed and now let's put some more options here so this is the hover class which includes a, a new class called border that we can style in CSS into your um, div and now in here we type tolerance which is another cool feature and here we type touch okay what this does is and uh, whenever we touch the box with um, with whatever we are dragging uh, it turns uh, right away into um, it turns its outputs that solid um, border and black okay and you have some other options you can use I'm going to use this one touch and um, now another is accept okay and this means what is uh, what is the spans or the IDs you want to accept to drop in that box so if I choose name you'll see that let's type here div name only the names will be able to be dropped in the box okay and for now uh, we uh, know that they are able to drop be dropped in the box because we have that uh, border solid border and black if I put London you see we don't have that effect anymore okay because I mentioned only I only want the names to be able to uh, be dropped there okay so after name we type let's type coma and now let's type here over two points function parenthesis and curly braces and in here I'm going to type um, I'm going to grab the drop box and type text in here let's type um, something is hovering let's save this 
Let's go back. Let's refresh. And you'll see that whenever I start hovering something over the box, the something is hovering appears um, immediately. Okay. Another function that we can use is the out function, parenthesis and curly braces, and the out. Let me copy this. Oops. Paste. And instead of something is severing, we can say something is dragged out of the box. Okay, let's see if that works. refresh and if I start hovering something is hovering if I go out something is dragged out of the box okay perfect so another one we can use is uh, drop function parenthesis square curly braces and now let me paste this and here something has been dropped in the box okay let's refresh and now something is hovering if I go out something is dragged out of the box if I go back in and leave it there something has been dropped in the box okay perfect what I want to do next is to be able to drop that and see that inside the box and to stay there okay so to do that let's uh, in here and the drop let's take this out and Let's type here Dropbox, of course, and here we type append contents. Uh, contents plus br because I want that in a list type inside the box. Save this and let's refresh and let's take this messages out so here here and um, and the over out as well okay we see if everything is okay perfect Perfect. Okay, uh, let's proceed. Let's refresh. Let's see if this works. Now I grab. Oops, not working. Okay, I've done something wrong here. Let me check. Okay, I have to put this in my column in here. and uh, take this out save it and of course here after name comma and here I need to type drop function parenthesis And this is going to be copy inside here, paste, and take this out, and 
this out as well. Okay. So let's open this in Chrome, refresh. And if you now grab Victor, for example, and leave it there, there it is. If I grab Tom, perfect. London is not working because we just made here accept name. But if we take that out, refresh, save, and we refresh, we will be able to put anything inside a box. London, Tom, Victor, and we can even repeat Victor as many times as we want. Okay, This is a pretty uh, cool feature that you can use to uh, put a um, to create a shopping cart or something like that, okay, and buy some sausages or something, or some Coca Colas or beers or whatever you want, okay. Um, as you can see, it still goes down, but um, I can put in here the mm, containment. Let's type this containment copy and put in here paste parent mm, I think it's here let me see refresh let's try this again Well, it's not here. Parent. It's probably here in the draggable. Let's refresh. Well, I still don't know how to avoid this. I'm going to try to search how to avoid this problem. But um, I will tell you the, later on how to avoid this. Okay, guys, so this is all for now. Now you can uh, drag and drop whatever you want. Um, so see you guys in the next video. Bye.